so I assigned the task to myself to create an Android game in 24 hours. For reference, I have published two games before on Android and both are super duper. So for this, I decided to make a one tap game because Android users are lazy. So if you don't know, one tap games are literally games which are played with one tap. Yeah, great explanation, right? The example of one tap game is Flappy Bird. So talking about Flappy Birds, I decided to make a game with some kind of birds involved. So I looked in my world and found I have this hen model ready and animated. So the next task is to find what our game is going to be. I was thinking of making a platformer with procedurally generated level. The animation I got with the packs are literally amazing. So you see yourself. <laughs> so I professionally stole them. I rendered the chicken to the level and make it run. Run from KFC as far as you can. So next I added some blocks and so that my so that my chick can jump. So now as our chicken can jump, I remove the floor. So next I was confident enough to write a program that would procedurally generate the level. And after compilation, the expected has happened. The whole engine crashed. And after trying a little and improving the code, I compiled again and it's working now. Well, sort of working. Damn it. So I tried a little more and improved the code and then it's working fine now. Great. So next I created some more blocks like this. Like this. Like this. So next the error of jumping at a wrong time is very high. So to overcome this let's add a super power that is double jump. So I implemented that. It's working fine but it's not visually impressive. So you know what to add next. Particle effect. So now chicken is launching up after farting. I can't stop my imagination to implement that. So next I added the material to the walls. So next I moved to Blender and imported some simple models from real. Like this ball, this spike, this spinning wheel. So I added these spikes randomly to the level. When you hit them, yeah, okay, it's game over. So next to let our chicken fart as much as player want, I added this balls that will increase the ability of chicken to fart. To make this more epic, you know the answer. Particle effect. So it is weird to let chicken eat a ball. So as a chicken expert, I googled it. Yeah. Chicken. I don't know what to make. I made the model of a pouch which will have whatever the chicken wants. Nice. In a, and yes, also I made a black pouch that will have whatever the chicken hates. And it will decrease the farting ability of the chicken. So at this point, it's been 19 hours across. So I left the game as it is and worked on the thing I hate the most menus and UI and at last I come up with this the chicken is animated and in a loop you click play to play the game and pause the game resume or go back to the menu and also edit the retry and menu screen in game over so I have three hours left by now I took one hour break to relax my eyes and then downloaded some royalty free music online and after that added them to the game and the result is this
by this the game is ready and with the spare time i created the icons and all the screenshot and the loading screen for the game and i also exported i also added a simple banner ad not too many ads and by this time the app is uploaded on play store uh, you can see the link of the game down in the description and i hope you like the game i know it's not much but i'm still learning and hopefully i will make a good gaming feature in 24 hours so hit like if you like this video subscribe if you loved it and see you guys in the next one peace